Hi, it's me again. I was going to wear them all American hat, but I, I don't think it's necessary. But, um, along with my request video, I did a, you know, the upload a request video. I'm going to say some things. And I'm going to have to, um, I'm going to be brief. And this is going to be brief. And this is going to be a message. To people, we need strong masculine men. And I get this car turned on now. Let me turn this car off. I'm still sitting in the parking lot over by the um, grocery store that I went to. But I just wanted to mention that there needs to be strong masculine men. And strong masculine men is not toxic masculinity. It's strong masculine men, godly men that will do the right thing. Who represent the strong masculine heterosexual man, not bisexual, heterosexual. Anyway, strong men. And people need to know about that and call that back into, and many people in fellowships need to address that and check in the description if I decide to link a video or something to that or on my, in my PO box. I, always, I usually like to put my PO box in the description. Masculine men. And don't listen to these men talking about uh, strong masculinity is toxic masculinity. We don't want that, and we don't we we don't want uh, something that they consider toxic masculinity. We want real masculine men, strong men that protect, that lead the family, not a control freak, not somebody that's gonna be abusive. Just strong masculine men. And let the men do what they're supposed to do. If the men come into place and do what they're supposed to do and be respectful and manable and do what they're supposed to do, it will help society come in place. And when we don't have that, it's lacking of society. So we need strong men to stand up. And that's... All I'm going to say about that.